The 2023 Campbell County High School graduation brought to you in part by these outstanding corporate partners. Alco Builders and Realty, David Bales Buick GMC, Dr. Jill Browning, number 30, Biltwell Bank, CNL Furniture, Collectibles and More, CNL Metal Sales, Citizens Bank, The Town of Caraville, Days Lawnmower Parts and Service, Deals Distributing, Community Trust Bank, Ron Dilbeck, Road Superintendent, El Pueblito Authentic Mexican Restaurant, First National Bank, Brittany Faust, Register of Deeds, Gamble Motors, Race Rehab, Hearthside Bank, Hensley Tire and Service La Follette and Huntsville, Campbell County 2nd District Commissioner Scott Scotty Kitts, Jacksboro GNC, La Follette Utilities Board LUB, The City of La Follette, La Follette Mine Supply, Lithocraft Printing and Office Supplies, Jack Lynch, Mayor of Campbell County, Maynard's New and Used Auto Parts, Maynard's Record Service, New Horizon Baptist Church, Norris Lake Boat Center, Body Lawn Sales and Service, Powell Clinch Utility District, PCUD, People's Bank of the South, Todd Nance, County Court Clerk, Robbins Guttering Roofing and Siding, Smith Metals, Southern Sass Boutique, TCAT, The Pine Branch, a Tennessee Artisan Mercantile, United Cumberland Bank, Valley Roofing, Walters Funeral Home, Winter Furniture, and WLAF. Good evening, everyone. If you please rise to recognize our seniors.
say, can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the reports we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rockets regular the bombs bursting in air gave proof through the night that our flag was still there oh say does that star spangled banner yet wave o'er the land of the free and the home of the brave The ceremony is a tribute to the hard work and sacrifice that has made this moment possible. So join me in honoring this great milestone each student has achieved here today with a prayer to our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Please bow your heads. Dear good and gracious Heavenly Father, we come before you today with thank thankfulness. We praise and uplift your holy name as we celebrate all of the accomplishments we have made, as well as the hardships we have overcome to be here today. We come before you now to ask for your powerful protection over us as we start our new journey. Today is a culmination of years of work, years filled with challenges and triumphs, losses and laughter, friendships and growth. We thank you, Lord, for getting us safely to this day, and we pray for the families of those who should have been here with us today that you give them peace and comfort. We thank you for the gift of family, friends, teachers, and staff who have supported our graduates. We pray that as they go forth into the world, they may remember you are in all things. To you we give all the glory and thanksgiving. In Jesus' holy name we pray, amen. You guys may be seated. Good evening, everyone. I'm Lee McCamey, and it is my pleasure to welcome students, families, and staff to Campbell County's Class of 2023 graduation. To our faculty at school, I'm confident I'm speaking on behalf of every student here when I say each and every one of you have made a positive impact on our high school career. Your hard work and support towards us definitely does not go unnoticed and we are forever grateful for it. To our parents, we could have not made it without you, without your endless love and support with everything you do. To my mom and dad specifically, I would never be at the spot I'm in today without you being deeply concerned who stole my four points when I made a 96 on a test. I now want to take a minute to acknowledge our classmates that have made a commitment into joining the military right after graduation. These students are Lily Slover, U.S. Navy, Bryce Clark, Air Force, Robbie Haynes, National Guard, Crystal Oric, Army. Congratulations to you guys and thank you for your service. I cannot express how proud I am of our class as a whole. We've been through many heartaches and troubles, but we stood by each other in a time of need. I'm forever thankful for my friends and all the memories God has blessed me with during these four years at Campbell County. It truly has been an honor to experience it with you guys. Congratulations, class of 2023. I'm very excited to see all the great things waiting for us in the future. Thank you. If 
we have any seniors in choir that are still sitting down, you all are welcome to come join us. Cassie. Johnny. Where's server? Oh, here you come. Oh, yeah. There she is. Come on, Cassie. Yeah, we kind of need him. <laughs> He's our solos. We kind of need him up here. Johnny, you're up front. Johnny, you're between us. Oh, we're doing a song. Oh. Good evening, fellow graduates, faculty, family, and friends. My name is Drew Crowley, and I'm extremely thankful and honored to stand here and speak to everyone today. First off, I would like to thank God for blessing me with this opportunity. I know none of this will be possible without Him. To my family, I want to thank you for being my constant support system, always there to provide me encouragement and guidance when I needed it the most. 
As I reflect on my high school journey, I'm filled with gratitude for the friendships I forged during this time. Whether it was celebrating a district title with my teammates, studying for a Copeland test with my classmates, or being mentored by my tennis coach and U.S. history teacher, I cherish every memory and friendship I have made. So to my friends, I want to express my heartfelt appreciation for these countless memories and for the laughter we have shared throughout the years. You have made high school an unforgettable experience, and I am blessed to have met such incredible people. I look forward to creating more memories with you as we embark on the next chapter of our lives. As we move forward, I want to leave you with this thought. Everything happens for a reason. No matter what challenges we faced or what obstacles we encountered, we have all ended up here for a reason. Even when things don't go according to plan, it is crucial to trust the journey and believe that there is a purpose for everything. In closing, I want to remind you all that this is not the end, but the beginning of a new chapter in our lives. Let us embrace the future and continue to strive for the best in all that we do. Thank you. My name is Sophia Fritz, and I am incredibly excited to be here speaking to you guys today. Approximately 13 years, 4,745 days. That is how long our school career has lasted. We've been here all that time, but it's only felt like one minute. One minute until the bell rings, one minute until we can leave class, or one minute until practice is over. Just one minute. Since we were all kids, we've wished and rushed and waited until our time in school was up. Having one year before graduation turned into one semester. Then you blink your eyes and then you have one month. Then it's one week. And now, just a few minutes. I personally would give anything to have one more minute sitting in Ms. Copeland's class or one more minute watching Ms. Browning's dance moves or as she's liked to call them, cheerleader kicks. I know we all here wish that we had one more minute up in the stands on a Friday night, but we don't. Our time here's up. And for just a minute, I'd like us to remember our classmates and our friends who we wish we could spend just one more minute with. Connor Lane. His warm, tight hugs and hilarious jokes could make even the saddest person instantly happy. Dominic Zapanzik. He had the broadest smile, the biggest heart, and he was the most adventurous person I've ever met. Angelina Tidwell. She was the smartest, boldest, most carefree person her friends knew, and her kindness could brighten anyone's day. These precious souls are still so loved, and I know that we all wish they could be here today, if only for just a minute. So, here's my challenge to you, class of 2023. From today forward, Live like you've only got one minute left. Hold your days in both of your hands and cherish every single moment. Stop wishing away your time because so much can happen in just one minute. I'm so incredibly proud of us and I can't wait to see how each one of us changes the world. Thank you. Good evening, parents, staff, and class of 2023. My name is Bailey McKamey. We're here today celebrating our last day as seniors, celebrating our last days at this campus, and celebrating the past decade. We are saddened by the thoughts that this is the end, but this is really where our stories begin. This is the beginning of several more changes. Some of us will go to college, some will go to tech school, and some will move immediately into the workforce. This is a day to celebrate. We have the rest of our lives to live. We've been through a lot since our elementary school days. COVID robbed us of some of our time together, but we persevered. We also lost close friends along the way. We battled through the tough times and we're all here because we fought our own personal battles and overcome them. We're bound to have many more battles, some harder than others. We must continue fighting. We must not give up. Romans 8.37 says, In all things we are more than conquerors through him that loved us. We are loved and we can overcome difficult times if we just keep pushing. Remember, even in your hardest times, there's always someone out there who loves you and is rooting for you. Life will get hard, but remember you're not alone. You always have a cheerleader somewhere. I want to thank my mom and dad for always being my biggest cheerleaders and helping to shape me into the person I am today. Thank you to the students, teachers, parents, and staff who made our school days everything they were. 
Everyone here today has made an impact on the graduates who sit here, continue to help them write their stories, be their biggest cheerleaders, and love them through their hardest times. I can't leave the stage today without mentioning our friends who left us too soon. Angelina Tidwell, Dominic Zupanzik, and Connor Lane. When times get hard, we must remember them and fight even harder. We must push through. We must live our lives in honor and remembrance of them. Their stories into, ended too soon, so we must keep writing hours for them. My hope for all of us is that our stories continue, our cliffhangers are resolved, and we can have happy endings. Thank you. Thank you all for coming out tonight. My name is Parker Stanfield, and I've had the privilege of attending Campbell County High School for the last four years of my life. And let me tell you, they've been some of the best times of my life. I would like to start off by thanking God for putting me in this position that I'm in today. I cannot have done any of this without him and the plan he has for me. To all the teachers, administrators, and faculty that has had a hand in my school experience these last 14 years of my life, since pre-K up until now, thank you. None of this would be possible without you. To my classmates and some of my best friends, I'm so thankful you all have been along this crazy ride with me. I cannot imagine doing this with anyone else. You all have truly made me feel so lucky and honored to have done this with you all. Some of the bonds I have made in high school have made this only child feel like he has had the best siblings in the whole entire world, and I wouldn't change that for anything. I wouldn't be who I am today without some people in my life speaking good into me day in and day out. To my mom and dad, Thank you, too, for raising me and putting up with anything that I wanted to do or get involved with, taking me to all my practices, making sure I had everything that I ever needed, and for molding me into the man that I am today. You two are a true testament to what it means to truly love a child unconditionally, and for that I am grateful. I will love you all forever and always. To my late grandma, taking care of me every day when I was little and making sure that I never went without anything that I ever wanted and more. I long to make you proud, and I love and miss you more than you'll ever know. To the man that has single-handedly made these last four years feel like a movie, Mr. Josh Parker, thank you for hauling me around everywhere under the sun for these last four years, for all the talks over meals and taking me in as a brother. Your friendship will soon not be forgotten. And lastly, to my second mother, whom I wish was here right now, Mama C, Miss Cindy Reynolds, thank you for always pushing me when I was little and telling me that the sky's the limit. Our talks on each other's front porches about the future and life itself will never be forgotten. You have truly encouraged me to go on and do great things in this life. One thing that has always stuck with me is a quote by the late great boxer Muhammad Ali. He said, who, he who is not courageous enough to take risks will accomplish nothing in life. If you want something, go after it. Set your mind to it and you can achieve it. If you believe in your heart that you can obtain whatever it is, you've already got it. Believing in yourself is half the battle. As we all go our separate ways tonight into a different chapter of our lives, I'm just glad to say that our paths crossed and we all got this experience together. Thank you. Good evening, friends, family, and classmates. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Harper Steiner. I'm so honored to be standing here today. As I sat here last year as a graduation usher, surrounded by many friends and their proud family members, I felt a sense of sadness but accomplishment. Even though I was not graduating myself, I got to experience what this means to so many through the perspective of someone about to head down that road. I listened to many speeches by multiple students encouraging their peers and giving advice for the future and what lies ahead. I watched plenty of happy and even sad tears shed, but most of all, I watched the kids who I had passed in the hallways and seen in classrooms show an appreciation for the things that they would soon miss. High school has been the best years of my life, so as I sat here last year as a junior, taking it all in and not knowing what would come next, I vowed to myself that even in this last year, I would make the most of it. I would take as many pictures, say yes to as many plans, and do my best to live my life to the fullest. In the brief time that I had left, with the people who I'd spent the last six to 12 years growing up with. Senior year brings with it a lot of elements, but the most noticeable are the last. The last first day, the last football game on the hill, the last spring break, and the hardest of all, the last bell. But with along, along with those way too many lasts come plenty of firsts. The first college visit, the first acceptance letter, the first scholarship application, and most of all, the first step towards a new future. 
This past year, I have flourished into a person who lives with no regrets and takes the chances that are in front of them, even if that means embarrassing myself more times than I can count. I have gotten out of my comfort zone, joined about every club imaginable, and became friends with people who I never could have imagined would make such a monumental impact on my life. I have enjoyed the first and grown thankful for the last. With that being said, the experiences that I've had and the memories that I've made are timeless, and I will cherish them forever. Before I go, I would like to give thanks to those who deserve it most in my life, because I would not be standing here without them. First, I would like to thank God for the opportunities that he has provided for me and being the strong foundation in my life. I want to thank my Yeezy for being my biggest fan, my harshest critic, and my best friend. I want to thank my dad for being the best advice giver and an awesome role model. You two were always there to support me and, I, and love me on my good and bad days. I know I never would have made it here without y'all. I want to thank my mama for countless nights on FaceTime, studying for upcoming assignments, or even just being there to talk about my day. I would like to thank my other family members, each of my friends, and their families as well for supporting me and being there for me at the end of every day without fail. Lastly, but certainly not least, I want to thank all of my teachers and counselors throughout the years for pouring into me the knowledge, wisdom, and confidence to go on in life and make something great out of myself. Your guidance and patience has molded me into not only the student that I am today, but has taught me to feed into others in my community what I would like to receive. Speaking to the juniors who are sitting here as ushers this year, and speaking to the family members and friends sitting as you watch your graduate complete their final steps of high school, I would like to say to you that it's never too late to make the most of it and live your life. Always be thankful and gracious to those who love you for who you truly are. Thank you and congratulations, class of 2023. <laughs> Good evening, students, families, and friends. I'm Olivia Raines, and I'd like to share some of the achievements of the class of 2023 with you. At Senior Awards Night on May 8th, Mr. Josh Parker recognized the names of the students who are in the top 10 of the class, as well as our Roan State Middle College graduate. These students who are sitting in the front row will be the first to receive their diplomas today. If you are in the top 10 of the class of 2023, or a Roan State Community College Middle College student, please stand and remain standing. 130 class <laughs> 130 class members were recognized who earned the status of being a Tennessee Ready graduate. These students met these criteria in one or more of the following ways. A score of 21 or higher on the ACT, the completion of four post-secondary opportunities, the completion of two early post-secondary opportunities and earning an industry credential, or the completion of two early post-secondary opportunities and earning a score of military readiness on the ASFAB test. If you are wearing a green honor cord to indicate you are a Tennessee Ready graduate, please stand and remain standing. Yay. <laughs> We have 15 students who have met certain benchmark scores on the ACT, as well as having a minimum grade point average of 3.0. These students are wearing silver honor cords. If you are graduating with honors, please stand and remain standing. Forty-six seniors are graduating with distinction and are wearing orange honor cords. These seniors have a minimum GPA of a 3.0, but also have met one or more of the following criteria. They have earned at least a 12 they have earned at least 12 hours of college credit through dual enrollment, earned a national industry certification in a career and technical education area. They have attended a Tennessee governor's school. They have attained a 31 or higher composite score on the ACT, or they have scored a three or above on two or more advanced placement exams. If you're graduating with distinction, please stand and remain standing. Thirty-two local businesses, organizations, and private donors have given scholarships on Senior Awards Night. If you are a recipient of a local scholarship, please stand and remain standing. If you received an academic or athletic scholarship from a college or university, please stand and remain standing. If you received the top student in a subject or area from one of your teachers, please stand and remain standing. 
If you receive the Tennessee Achieves Scholarship, which pays for two years of college tuition at a community college or college of technology in the state of Tennessee, please stand and remain standing. If you will receive the Tennessee Hope Lottery Scholarship based on a 21 or higher composite score on the ACT or a 3.0 GPA, which pays $3,200 per year at a two-year college or $4,500 per year at a four-year college, please stand and remain standing. Finally, I'd like to take a moment to recognize seniors with perfect attendance. Jacob Comer and Parker Stanfield have not missed a day of school all year. Alexis Potts has had perfect attendance for the past two years. Please join me in applauding their efforts. <laughs> Family and friends, take a look at the achievements of Class of 2023 at Campbell County High School. Rest assured that we will enter the world representing the best of what our community has to offer. Thank you. Would the first row please stand and approach the stage to receive your high school diplomas. Andrew Stephen Crowley. Sophia Abigail Fritz. Jonathan Wesley Long. Bailey Deborah McCamey. Leah Ashlyn McCamey. Olivia Fay Rains. <laughs> Lily Kate Slover. <laughs> Parker Glenn Stanfield. <laughs> Harper Annette Steiner. <laughs> Lauren Joe Van Beber. Bryson Jacob Dotson. Bryce McKenna Oke Akua Clark. Robert Paul Haynes, Jr. Kayla Erica Gibson. <laughs> Crystal Sue Oric. Tristan Ward Ackerman. Woo! 
Charles Samuel Adams. Michael David Adkins II. Michael Wayne Albright, Jr. Hannah Jane Allen. Landon John Anderson. Lauren Taylor Asher. Eli Jordan Austin. Destiny Marie Ayers. Dan Lee Allen Bailey. Aiden Michael Baird. Jordan Lee Baird. Aiden Andrew Bales. Seth Austin Beatty. Angelia Nicole Bechtel. Caitlin Faith Berry. <laughs> Jeremiah Lavon Bowlinger. <laughs> Abigail Grace Bollinger. <laughs> Jackson Wayne Bolton. Tommy Lee Boshears. Andrew Caden Bostick. Rayleigh Michelle Boreff. Alyssa Abigail Bowling. Peyton Ray Lee Brandenburg. Alexia Briquet. Shelby Elizabeth Brock. Jordan Tyler Brooks. Alyssa Cheyenne Brown. Logan Michael Brown. Stacy Deshay Brown. Noah Avery Burden. Dominic Fagan Burris. Jacob Trey Burge. Addison Taylor Caps. Ethan William Carr. Audrey Grace Carroll. Hunter Lewis Chapman. Hey. 
Brianna Hope Childress. Caden Michael Clausen. Elijah Xavier Kogan. Aiden Justin Cole. Haley Elizabeth Collins. Jacob Howard Comer. Zachary Allen Condry. Madeline Brooke Cordell. Ethan Gregory Correa. Cassidy Ann Cox. Skyler Cox Mitchell. Olivia Faith Criswell. Brandon Scott Cummings. Caleb James Dabney. Samantha Rose Dagley. Aiden Ramsey Darty. Alana Faith Darty. Justin Curtis Darty. Austin Brian Davidson. Cheyenne McKenzie Davis. Kylie Faith Davis. Jonathan Timothy Disney Bolton. Rachel Hope Dixon. Brandon Timothy Dopel. Haley Grace Dopp. Brittany Jo Drummonds. Chloe Camille Durham. Brooke Sierra Edge. Isaac Ray Elliott. Jonna Elizabeth Grace Ellison. Shelby Sue Marie Ellison. Ricardo Eloy. Sage Alina Elwin. Noah Ryan Emery. Colton Damon Evans. Chance Austin Lee Farmer. Peyton Alexander Ferguson.
Miranda Fernandez Campos. Hayden Scott Fields. Molly Kate Fields. Emily Elizabeth Finkenbein. Melanie Jade Fowler. Haley Olivia Fox. Jeremiah Cole Fox. Aaliyah Faith Gagney. Brennan Matthew Gagnon. Danny John Garrett. Chesney Faith Gibson. Jacqueline Savannah Gibson. Jackson Caleb Goad. Faith Marie Rose Goins. Gunner Allen Goins. Corbin Edward Goins. Mackenzie Page Goins. Riley Caden Goins. Alejandra Nicole Gossick. Adam Alexander Gunter. Kaylee Rose Guyton. Lorian Claire Hall. Matthew Eli Hamblin. Kiera Hope Hammers. Hannah Marie Harness. Lily Ray Hatfield. Skylar David Hayes. Chase Andrew Hazelwood. Jacob Scott Jameson Head. Michael Daniel Helms. Austin Schuyler Hembry. Ava Joan Marie Henniger. Nicholas Xander Hicks. Landon Robert Higginbotham. Olivia Ann Hopson. Caleb William Huddleston. Dylan Cole Hull. Oh, 
Brendan Tyler Hurst. Lacey Annabelle Marie Insco. Grayson Lee Isley. Reagan Marie Ivy. Zaylin Jada Brooke Ivy. Ethan Alexander Johnson. Jocelyn Faith Johnson. Madeline Hope Johnson. Madison Brooke Johnson. Devin Ray Jones. Eli Bradley Jones. Jesse Lee Jones. Savannah Lucille Jones. Savannah Nicole Kemp. Ryan Patrick Kennard. Zachary Carter Kennedy. Hannah Nicole Kimberlin. Isaiah Todd Kitts. Nathan Matthew Niffin. Benjamin Franklin Kohler. Connor Clay Lane in memoriam. Ava Lynn Lankford. Wyatt James David Lawless. Lacey Murray Leach. Michael Isaac Lee. Peyton Elizabeth Lee. William Michael Lester. Kenzie Ray Letner. Jody Ann Longmire. Shelby Jean Lowe. Adriana Trinity Lee Marlowe. Carmen Mackenzie Marlowe. Ethan Chandler Marlowe. Dylan Allen Marnie. Samantha Hope Mashburn. James Eli Massingill. Farah Elizabeth Maxwell.
Isaiah Edward McCarty. Rachel Elizabeth McCauley. Izzy Naomi McCullough. Sydney Alexis McCamey. Kyle Chase McKillop. Elijah Job McKinney. Sophia Madison McLean. James Clay Meredith. Ethan Tyler Miller. Ethan J. Mazel. Trinity Rose Monday. Caleb Hunter Muncy. Nevea Ann Munoz. Nicholas Wayne Muse. Emily Alicia Norman. Haven Nicole Oaks. Jesse Raymond Og. Carolee Francis Oric. Logan Chase Ornelas. Lacey Murray Owens. Blake Connor Parrott. Didi Babuai Patel. Malan Vijay Patel. Nathan Blaine Payne. Joshua Isaiah Micaiah Petrie. Joanna Lynn Jade Phillips. Madison Ann Phillips. Jacob Connor Pierce. Alexis Brooke Potts. Carlos Isaac Calis. Edward Gordon Rayburn. Hannah Jean Reese. Paul Reynolds the second. Callie Brooke Rice. Skylar Teresa Richards. James Matthew Riggs. Giselle Guadalupe Rivera Morales. Abigail Mariah Roberts. Landon Blake Roberts. Timberland Noah Anthony Roberts. Megan Ashley Ross. Yeah. 
Reese Catherine Rosser. Alessandro Rossi. Benjamin Matthew Russell. Eva Irene Russell. Abigail Dakota Salinas. Madison Logan Salinas. Aaliyah Brianne Sanders. Adama Francis Sonogo. Justin Taylor Sewell. Mason Gregory Wayne Shanks. Cora Jesse Renee Shelton. Mahala Jury Shelton. Holly Farise Shepherd. Whitney Cheyenne Shepherd. Grayson Ian Silcox. Chloe Ashlyn Simmons. Sydney Malia Sims. Neil Aiden Slesman. Eli Ronald James Smitty.
John Zapanzik in memoriam. Kimber Marie Wilson in memoriam. to express how incredibly proud and impressed I am of each and every one of you. You are on the verge of stepping into a world full of endless possibilities. As you embark on the next chapter of your lives, remember that you are well prepared to face the challenges that lie ahead. Embrace opportunities to pursue your passions with determination and always strive for excellence. Your high school experiences has instilled in you the values of perseverance, integrity, and resilience, values that will guide you through uncertain, uncertain times and propel you towards success. In this special moment, we're witnessing a meaningful act, the, shift, the act of shifting your tassel from the right side to the left side of your graduation caps. This simple gesture represents a significant change it signifies the transformation from students to graduates, from learners to leaders. It represents all the hard work, dedication, and personal growth that has brought you to this very moment. You are stepping beyond youth and into adulthood. Gradu graduates, at this time, please stand. Move your tassel from the right to the left. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the graduating class of 2023. Go up, 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 as you 
The 2023 Campbell County High School graduation brought to you in part by these outstanding corporate partners, Alco Builders and Realty, David Bales Buick GMC, Dr. Jill Browning, number 30, Biltwell Bank, CNL Furniture, Collectibles and More, CNL Metal Sales, Citizens Bank, The Town of Caraville, Days Lawmore Parts and Service, Deals Distributing, Community Trust Bank, Ron Dilbeck, Road Superintendent, El Pimplito Authentic Mexican Restaurant, First National Bank, Brittany Faust, Register of Deeds, Campbell Motors, Race Rehab, Hearthside Bank, Hensley Tire and Service La Follette and Huntsville, Campbell County 2nd District Commissioner Scott Scotty Kitts, Jacksboro GNC, La Follette Utilities Board, LUB. The City of La Follette. La Follette Mine Supply. Lithocraft Printing and Office Supplies. Jack Lynch, Mayor of Campbell County. Maynard's New and Used Auto Parts. Maynard's Record Service. New Horizon Baptist Church. Norris Lake Boat Center. Body Lawn Sales and Service. Powell Clinch Utility District, PCUD. People's Bank of the South. Todd Nance, County Court Clerk. Robbins Guttering Roofing and Siding. Smith Metals. Southern Sass Boutique. TCAT. The Pine Branch, a Tennessee Artisan Mercantile. United Cumberland Bank. Valley Roofing. Walters Funeral Home. Winter Furniture. And WLAF. <laughs> 